cage uh, cabooses and we finished uh, yesterday we finished uh, the, the the frame for the roof assembly and now we're uh, doing the, uh, the the roof assembly uh, the frame for the center cupola caboose and I've just gone ahead and got the the two long pieces um, measured and we need to notch them out um, for the cupola to, to be there and we'll do that and i want to go ahead and mark uh, which ones are the this is the front here we'll do front and i can do this so uh, one and two this here's the back and back and here we have one and two and this here is going to be the front and back And front is that way, and front is that way. Okay. Marking where we need to notch this out. So this is 18 inches, so we want this one to be right at 9. Yeah, we're at 18. So I can come over 9 inches for the center. We have all the pieces. They okay. We have all the pieces. They all uh, fit nicely. We have marked them all. So now what I want to do is uh, notch out these two boards and make sure they fit in there nicely. And then we'll come along and cut this. Well, we'll, uh, we'll go ahead and cut this off and glue and nail the frame together. notches right here and there for the um, cupola to sit into. Make sure they line up nicely. And they do.
Now there is a little teeny, this isn't quite flush with this because we got to carry this angle to the outside of the roof. So that's, went ahead and measured it that way. Do the same thing on this side. There we go. Okay, we have this part of the frame done. Uh, we'll cut this off and then we'll put these final um, cross beams on once we have the cupola cut off. up right where we want it to go. So we will. Pretty good. Now I need to take these clamps off. Take our guide off and we'll flip the car around. Get this one cut. Here comes the moment of truth. Let's see if our, let's see, I think we got the, front, look at that, that fits in there nicely, woohoo, just the way it's supposed to, and we got the back, front, all right. Okay. That's in there nicely. So now we want to. Let's see. U or D. So U. Let's go right here. Now, I'm clamping this frame in place so we know right where we want it to be. And then this is the older kit that 
we got out of the estate sale and so the wood's a little bit warped, but I'll clamp this in tight. Nice. Okay, that's where we want that. Um, Drawing some lines where I know where to put the glue, and we should be able to glue this in place. I decided I'm going to go ahead and use the lo longer pins on on this. Um, they will come all the way through just a little bit. That's okay. Is then I'll just use the uh, little grinder and cut them off. Um, the other ones I have are a little bit too short, so... Oh. Be right back. I need our wax paper. Okay. Well, we are back, and what we've done is on this um, roof here, we finished up the we we finished up this frame. We glued and nailed the um, the cupola um, structure to the frame, and then we went ahead and put in the quarter inch by uh, one inch um, little. Um, collar around the inside of the locomotive, or excuse me, of the caboose here, and glued and nailed that, and that goes ahead and holds um, this roof from going down uh, too far, so it sets in there perfectly, so it's nice and, um, so the angle is, from here, is even with the edge here. And then what I've done is, instead of having two separate pieces of plywood for the roof, we went ahead and um, just went and got some quarter inch plywood and cut that so that it fits nicely right here. So I wanted to have this little roof section across here so that uh, when I put the trim across down here, you won't see that, um, that joint uh, from where the roof lifts up. And we'll do the same thing on this side. So what I'm going to do now is I have um, went ahead and marked where um, on the roof here where we want the nails to go and we'll put some glue on here and then we'll pin this down and we'll do the other side. Excellent. Take that. All right, like that.
sure we aren't nailed to the caboose. And it looks like all those except for one made it, so that two, three, cool. All right. All right, well, we got this all dialed in. We'll let this set up overnight. And then uh, I cut some um, one inch by, oh, uh, by about a quarter inch strips. And this will be that trim piece that will go basically right along here. And we'll put a little notch on each end. And that will um, finish off the trim on our, um, on our caboose. Uh, the first roof and then we'll figure out how to do the uh, roof on the cupolas next. All right. Well, I'm Holly McLean for Train Lee TV and thank you so much for watching. Please like us on Facebook and please follow us and subscribe to our channel on YouTube. That helps us out a lot and enables us to go ahead and let people know that they're watching, liking what we're doing and we'll continue to do more of these videos. Once again, I'm Holly McLean and thanks again for watching.